नमस्कार फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू एक्सपोर्ट इम्पोर्ट मैक इन इंडिया कैंपेन एंड टुडे इन दिस सेशन वी विल अंडरस्टैंड व्हाट आर द सेवन राइट्स ऑफ द इंटरनेशनल लॉजिस्टिक ओके सो फ्रॉम टुडे ऑनवर्ड वी आर स्टार्टिंग द सब्जेक्ट इंटरनेशनल लॉजिस्टिंग व्हिच इज द पार्ट ऑफ एमबीए ओके सो इन सेवन राइट ऑफ इंटरनेशनल लॉजिस्टिक फर्स्ट वी विल ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड व्हाट इज द इंटरनेशनल लॉजिस्टिक okay so international logistic is the uh, logistic in which goods move from one country to another country cross border so whenever the uh, shipment of uh, trade through uh, cross border it is uh, involve the logistic and the transportation and shipping which is the part of international logistic okay in simple language we can say inter in the international logistic the transportation um uh, through transportation goods move from one country to another countries cross border okay so here we will try to understand uh, what are the seven rights which are uh, which are part of international logistic okay without these seven rights international logistic cannot be performed right functionally okay so what are the seven right of the international listing getting the right product in right quality in right conditions at right place at the right time to the right customer at the right price is the international logistic of the seven right okay so let's study seven rights is better logistic management first right product okay so freight companies just like a transporters shipping lines airlines okay and whatever the logistic companies freight company should have a complete information about kind of product they are going to ship okay proper product knowledge is important for the management of the time and resources okay so in some time for example sometime if goods are perishable and you will not maintain the temperatures of the uh, transport uh, vehicle then it will be problem good will be spoiled so for that you need to understand uh, and uh, you should have a knowledge about the kind of product okay so here you need to select the right product okay here if you are if you are uh, efficiency is not uh, for that uh, handling the perishable good then you need to uh, avoid okay so here uh, right product to choose which you can uh, transport from one location to another seven right customer okay so next uh, right customer logistic company should know their target market so that they can identify their potential customer okay by targeting the right customer in the market they will have a better chance to gaining leads okay so here it is also important to right customer choosing by the logistic international logistic companies okay right quantities it is all it is also important to know right quantity of the product to be sent to retailer okay thanks for the modern ai system company can make right production predictions for the quantity of the goods to be sent near future based of the past record okay so uh, before expo uh, movement of the goods are dispatched the goods the invoice and packing list may define the quantity of the goods so they can deliver the same okay without knowing the volume of the goods it is not good to uh, deliver okay it will be problem maybe a high volume goods may be have a some problem okay like a, a transport uh, capacity is not uh, exceed from the limit okay then it will problem so quantity also need to be maintain and should have knowledge to the transport company okay now next one is right time okay so in the world shipping management time play critical roles okay there should be no delay when it's come delivery for the product and to customer prior planning and management need to be done in advance for the shipping in the right time okay so here uh, the the right time means that a timeline okay given by the uh, buyer is need to be fulfill the dispatch and shipment delivered okay else it will be a comes under the 
bed service okay so you need to complete the delivery in the time okay so for example any customers needs any product okay because that he his inventory is short and he he need to deliver to her next customer in given time so he will inform us to deliver this specific time period okay so we need to understand the requirement of the buyer and dispatch the shipments as prior planning and manage the needs in advance okay so this will be in right time okay if you not provide okay the shipment to the customer right time then they will uh, they will try to find out the another options where he can get the timely shipment okay timely goods now right conditions logistic firm should make sure about the condition of the product when it reach to the end customer okay means that whatever product you are going to deliver you need to handle in right way so the customer will get product in right conditions otherwise if customer will receive product in damaged condition will complain okay and your order will be cancelled so this is very important to understand the handling procedures while transporting the product shouldn't be broken and the packaging must be intact okay packaging of the product should be intact so that it will not broken broken there should be proper r&d so that product reach to the customer in right conditions okay in the international logistic the goods move from one nation to another nation so lot uh, maybe it, it takes too much time okay so you need to understand that in c case c export case the goods reach uh, in months are more than months so for that uh, you need to understand the r and d of, of the packing regarding the product so product shouldn't broken on the way and reach in right conditions okay now right price the company have a to rate the pricing along with the manages all shipment process the logistic company have to monitor the better freight routes for forecast exact landing unit for the efficiency cost this ensure the lowest cost from the their end here this working is for the logistic company okay so if logistic company provide the right prices for the product okay then he will get the competitive requirements or competitive uh, quotations from the exporters and other companies okay so here if the prices are the uh, right then the chance of uh, orders will increase okay and we also need to understand the right pricing is the imported because that nowadays lot of transport companies are available so along with right pricing service also should be right okay so that um, your customer service and uh, goodwill will uh, increase like a uh, performance okay if you are you are uh, charging the lower price but service is not providing in right right way then it will not go better service given to the customer okay so for that you need to understand how you can manage the pricing right price okay so you need to check out whether the right um, shipment routes through that you can transport the shipments okay so for example you have to export goods from india to china okay so in this case you have to you have a knowledge regarding the routes of the shipments otherwise you if you send the wrong uh, routes by the shipment then it will be charges higher than actual so that will be problem like for example you have to export some uh, clothing bag to the china okay so first you, what you will do you will pack the goods uh, pay bags and uh, stuff the container and send for the icd then after that icd you need to check out through uh, it will be okay for the rail transport or uh, by road transport so 
you have to check out whether pricing and service level. If both are okay, services are also okay and pricing also okay, then you can select the options for the logistic designing. Okay, by rail, it will be okay for by rail or it will be okay for roads. Okay, in such way, the next step, the shipment will move from C4 to the importer uh, destinations, uh, port of discharge. So you also need to understand the routes, which routes are easy and timely delivered. Okay, so these are the, these, these things, these are the factor which influence the pricing. Okay, so need to understand. Now, right place. Okay, what the points above six factor product doesn't reach to target locations. Okay, this is the final uh, point, which is the uh, uh, very important because it, if you are not delivering your product at right location, then all six, uh, six points, have it though no value. Okay. So you need to understand you have to deliver the goods at right locations desired by the customer. Okay. There should be proper location tracking from both customer as well company. And this will help in determining the deliver of the consignment to right place. Okay. So you have to understand the right uh, locations given by the customer you need to deliver the product on that location. So you need to check out invoice address or purchase order address and you need to deliver on that. Okay. So there should be proper location tracking of the truck loads from both customer as well as company. And this will help to determine the delivery of the consignment at the right place. Okay. If you check out uh, on the tracking way that shipment is going right way or not, if it's going on the wrong way, then instruct to driver to go with the right way okay so this thing will uh, help to uh, achieving the right place working okay so guys in this session we have understand the seven rights of the international logistic okay so guys uh, if you if you want to uh, learn more knowledge of the in, in international logistic we are just uh, we will just upload we will upload the new videos regarding the international logistics so guys thanks for watching the session have a nice day